fat is bad, it's not. It is essential to hormone function, brain function, thyroid, a bunch of stuff. You really, really need to have fat in your diet. Teenagers and women need the most fat because they have the most complex hormones. Men need less, and then adult men on TRT or TRT need almost none. You can essentially get away with just fish oil and be fine. So that looks like women need about 30% of their diet, their total calories for the day to come through good fat sources. Men need about 15%. And then again, men on TRT or that kind of thing need five to 10. That is one of the advantages of exogenous testosterone is that you need essentially no fat in your diet, which can really help in diet phases. I promise though, you don't need it, bro. You can do it. It's fine. You don't need that shit. Uh, unless it'll double your income or you know you're going to be a world champion, you do not need it. Fat is not your enemy, it is your friend. You need it for testosterone production and hormone production, cortisol, thyroid function, brain health, heart health, all of this stuff comes into play. However, for the three macronutrients, fat is the most calorie dense, it has nine calories per gram versus carbs and protein that has four. So while fat is calorie dense compared to the other macronutrients, it is essential. So you need to have fat in your diet even when you're in a diet phase to make sure that things are running. Your thyroid hormones that manage your metabolism are driven by fat. So you can add in avocado or nuts or high quality olive oil, that kind of thing that you can control directly by weighing it uh, is a great way to make sure that you're hitting your fat sources and tracking all of your micronutrients. You just don't want to push your calories too, too far into the excess.